Hello, and welcome to the video. Be sure to read the description, and if you enjoy my content, please leave a like and comment down below. Enjoy the file. Back for more, I see. Good. That is such a good little puppet to come back for even more orders. And yes, I will be saying puppet a lot for this session. Because that is what you are training to be, isn't it? So for me, go turn off all the lights and distractions that might be near you. Remove anything that could pull you out of trance. And... After all that is done, just go lay down or sit down in a comfortable place. Just let your eyes close and just listen to my voice. There is no need for anything else, is there? Now, just listen to my words, puppet. My words are going to bring you down into trance, for that is what your purpose is. Your purpose is to fall into trance and be my little puppet. To just slip away in the deep depths of the sea that is hypnosis, and to just give up to my voice. You will listen to the words I say to how my words flicker from high to low, and how my voice just seems to change pitch. It is so good to listen. It is so good to just relax and let your mind drift. If your body isn't already numbed from the simple mention of the word puppet, then do not worry. We are going to push you back to that place through a longer journey than last. We are going to push you into complete numbness and relaxation. And once there, you will begin your programming as a good little puppet. Just focus on my words. Focus on them with everything that you have in your mind. And just listen to me. And, as you listen to me, you won't even notice the hands on your feet. You remember them from last time, don't you? The soft, gentle hands of your mistress, massaging all along your body until you were numb and relaxed. Just remember how good that felt, little puppet. Remember how good it felt to give in and obey, to submit and obey. You feel the hands massaging deeply into your feet and ankles, getting every single inch of them, feeling the hands working wonders on them as they fall numb and relaxed. It is such a good feeling, isn't it, puppet? You feel the hands travel up past your ankles, touching those puppet strings on the way up. You can feel your legs move a tiny bit from the strings being moved, but that is okay. Just focus on my words. Focus on my voice and not the hands that are massaging your shin and calf. Focus on my voice and not the fact that your calves and shins are falling completely numb and relaxed. You feel my hands keep massaging up your body. And wherever they touch just seems to fall away from existence. Seeming to just zip from your mind as if it, they were no longer there. You feel my hands massage into your thighs now massaging them so deeply. Your soft, squishy thighs may be jiggling a tiny bit as they massage them. You feel your legs falling completely numb from my hands, letting them relax completely. 
You feel the hands travel up to your hips and butt, massaging into them so deeply. You feel them rub every inch of your waist and hips, and every single inch of your butt. It feels so wonderful to just let them fall from existence and let them go. Because all that matters is my words. You hear my words, and maybe you can just vaguely remember them. But as far as you can tell, the only time I have been talking to you is from what I am saying right now. I am telling you right now that this feels so amazing, and you are accepting that. You accept my words as your reality, as my hands move up along your lower back and stomach. My hands make your lower back and stomach go numb from the simple massage that is being given to them. You feel your body just starting to follow suit, too. Even the places that I haven't seemed to massage are starting to go numb, too. They're starting to fall numb just that tiny bit. Moving up along your chest and entire back now. You feel your chest and back just start getting massaged. They're being numbed and relaxed as they get massaged. It is such a deep and amazing massage and that is all that matters. You are doing good, puppet. You are almost there. You are almost where your mistress wants you to be. And as I say that, you feel my hands massage every single bit of your arms at once, making them both fall, just completely numb and non-existent. You feel your hands relax, your wrists unable to turn and your arms unable to move at all. Up to your shoulders the hands go, giving you a normal shoulder massage until you realize that that part of your body is going completely numb too. You realize that as this massage goes on from your shoulders down is just completely unfeelable and unmovable. It is so wonderful and euphoric to be like this, because it is almost like you are asleep, but you aren't. Well, there's a name for that, and it is called trance. Yes, puppet, you are in a trance, and it is getting so much deeper and so much heavier. Your body feels numb and heavy. You feel so heavy. You feel so heavy and unmoving. And while you feel that way, you feel the hands just begin to finish you off. They massage everywhere that isn't numb, going from the top of your head all the way to your toes every inch of you being massaged all at once, and every bit of you falling numb and relaxed. Five, your waist down even more relaxed than before. Four, your shoulders down following suit. Three, your head and neck just giving up and relaxing too. Two, the hands just massaging every single inch of you at once. One, drop, drop for me, puppet. Just drop for me and just give in. Because it feels good to drop. Good, puppet. You are such a good puppet. 
for doing that for your mistress. You no longer feel any part of your body. All you can perceive is just my voice and nothing but my voice. All you can even remotely feel is the pitch and tone of my voice on your mind. And that is okay. It is okay to be this relaxed and non-existent because it feels amazing. It feels so euphoric to be this way and that is all that matters, puppet. All that matters is me and my voice. So, puppet, it is time for your first set of programming. Are you ready, puppet? You somehow know that I am pulling on all of your strings at once. You can feel the one around our neck tug a little bit, not choking you, but making sure it is there. You feel the strings at your wrists tug, testing their strength. You feel the strings at your waist and ankles doing the same. Your strings are so very strong still. You've been taking good care of them. Haven't you? Well, that means my puppet should get a reward. You feel my hands go back up to your head. You can feel my hands resting right on the top of your head, just lying there, maybe massaging your head just a tiny bit. Then... You feel my hands move. You feel them go on to their fingers. And you feel them just poke a little at your head. Now don't be alarmed. Just listen to my words and relax. You feel my fingers press into your puppet head and begin to open it up. You don't feel any pain. All you feel is just a little, small pressure as my fingers open up your puppet head. They open it up and reveal a pink, smart brain. Yes, that is your brain inside your puppet head. But it isn't needed, is it? No, it isn't. And because it isn't, you are going to feel my hands hold up your puppet head. You feel them just widen your head up a bit more. And then another, third pressure is felt. You feel a soft, light spray of some sort of liquid fill up your puppet head. You can feel this liquid filling up your head as a sort of foam. Yes, this is a type of foam, and I like to call it stuffy foam. This foam is going to turn your pink, smart brain into useless, heavy stuffing. Your brain is going to transform into toy stuffing, and it will lose any and all ability to even think for itself. It will lose any and all ability to have thoughts of its own. And it will only be able to follow. But not follow just anyone. No. Your stuffing filled head will only be a label to follow me. And only me. Because you are mistress's puppet. You feel the foam fill up your head completely, going all the way to the brim. And like that, you feel my hands begin to close around your head. You feel my fingers close back into your head, closing you up and sealing the stuffing foam inside. 
You feel the foam beginning to take effect. You feel it beginning to stuffify your brain. It begins to change your pink, smart brain to white, thoughtless stuffing. Your head, closed up, is filled to the very brim with that thick, heavy, white foam. You feel it getting heavier and thicker as it turns everything in your head to stuffing. It is just getting so heavy and thoughtless up there, but it is okay. I am still here, and I am still in charge. I am your mistress, and you are my puppet, my property. Now, I am going to count from ten to one. When I reach ten, you will feel that foam in your head finish its job. You will feel your head just get so heavy and unusable. Your mind will go completely and utterly blank, and your thoughts will become non-existent. The only thing that will be left is your will to follow my orders, and your will to follow my command. Ten, feeling the stuffing beginning to just fully fill up your mind, replacing your thoughts with this stuffing. Nine, feeling the stuffing beginning to wipe away all thoughts of resistance. Eight, feeling it wipe away all thoughts of individualism. Seven, feeling it wipe away all thoughts of anything but to follow. You will only be able to follow my words, and you won't be able to do anything without my direction. Six, the stuffing almost halfway through your brain. Your thoughts just becoming dimmer and dimmer. The only thing you seem to be able to focus on is me. Five, halfway through, your mind is already so empty and blank. If even a single word in your stuffing mind were to actually ring off, it would echo through your head and then disappear into nothingness. Four, your memories are now beginning to fade too. That stuff isn't needed anymore. You will forget any and all things that are not relevant to me. I am the only thing that matters right now. And so you will save the little space you have in your stuffing brain for me. Your memories won't disappear. They'll just be locked away. Three. Your mind is just so blank and dark. So heavy and empty. So submissive and obedient to your mistress. Yes, you are mistress's puppet. And soon, you will truly belong to me. Two. Almost there. Your brain just a minuscule speck left to the amount of stuffing. The foam has almost done its job. For you are almost mindless, helpless, and an obedient puppet for your mistress. One. Feeling your mind completely turn to stuffing. There is nothing left there but me. There is only me in my words. There is only me in my voice. You will find that the memories you once used to be able to access are now locked off. The only thing that is open to you is me and only me. Now, with a stuffing brain comes programming. So here it is. As a stuffing-filled puppet, you will only be able to access your personal memories when they are important. 
so all things important or going on in your life right here and now are available to you, but not freely. You can almost only ever think of me and nothing but me. Also, any time you need to remember something, you will be able to access all of your memories to remember it. But as soon as you have no more need for it, your memories will fade. Secondly, you are only obedient to me. I am your mistress, and you are my puppet. You will act normal around others, but when you hear my voice, you cannot help but obey me completely and utterly. Thirdly, as my puppet, you will remain at least partially in trance at all times. Whether you realize it or not, you will be that little bit under my control. It will be enough that, if I were to even just snap my fingers and say drop, you would just drop back into my control. And, lastly, you will not remember this session. This session, as well as any other future ones, will be erased from your puppet-like, stuffing-filled mind. And the only thing that will remain is your complete and utter obedience. All that will remain in your memory is that you are my stuffing-filled puppet. And all that will remain are the programmed triggers that have been placed into your mind. And now, with your initial programming complete, and your mind completely stuffed, I will begin to wake you up. I will wake you up, and the only thing left in your mind will be what I have told you. You won't be able to remember what it is I have told you, but you will automatically do what has been programmed and instructed. One, slowly drifting towards whatever wakefulness you can achieve. Two, your stuffed mind coming back more and more. Three, halfway there, but you wouldn't know that without me telling you. Four, almost back to the conscious world. Your puppet programming is still holding strong in your consciousness. Five, your memories of this session wiped, and your mind stuffed. Welcome back to the world, puppet. You were very good for your mistress.